I know you're tired. Every interview, Mozzie's name, you know, it comes up. Yeah. Uh, I think two, three years ago, people say y'all squash beef. And then now you see it's still a gray area. Like, are you are you fed up with, with the whole situation? Like, are you over it? I've been over that shit, bro. I've been over that shit, bro. Like I said, bro, I don't, I don't be having problems with niggas. Niggas, you feel me? I'm a grown ass man. You get what I'm saying? Blood successful. I'm successful, bro. You get what I'm saying? I, I can't be mad at nobody. You get what I'm saying? And I'm sure nigga ain't mad at me by whatever it is. You get what I'm saying? So, yeah, I'd be hating when niggas even bring that shit up. You feel me? Yeah. Because there was a, a time period where as though I think y'all came together, right? And then... Nah, we ain't came together. We ain't seen each other. Okay. But I, I just thought it was a mutual understanding for a while that, you know, it's over with. Uh... I don't believe that ever happened. Uh, no, I don't believe that ever happened. Oh. Yeah. So we ain't hollered. Yeah. We ain't seen each other. We ain't talk. So, I mean, we don't need to. It's, it's a it's a lot of niggas niggas don't talk to. You feel me? That don't mean that, you know, it's an issue. It's just, nigga, you doing your thing. I'm doing my thing. I'm in my lane. You in your lane. You feel me? And that's just what it is. Like, period. Yeah. Do you feel like that kind of uh because you have a large fan base in Sacramento? Yeah. Did that kind of, you know, mess up things to where as though, you know, shows and things like no, that? I been couldn't do no shows in Sacramento. I can't even do no shows in Oakland, but uh before all that though. But uh I mean Sacramento was definitely one of the um first places that really embraced a nigga though, you know. Sacramento been showing a lot of love and nigga been showing a lot of love to Sacramento. But um, I mean it probably it probably drew, drew tension between the two out there. You feel me? I don't really know though. Okay. Yeah. In in the early stages, you you tried to sign Mozzie? Like y'all were like um, tight? I didn't try to, I could've, but I didn't. And not to try to take away nothing. I know motherfucker gonna try to twist it and make it seem like <laughs> There's a lot of rappers I could have signed, bro. Like some of the biggest rappers to this day that mm. niggas listening to got platinum plaques. I went in the studio, been in the studio with them and recorded songs. Niggas in my DM, I see the shit years later. All type of shit, bro. So it's, it's nothing like that. It's just, I mean, I could have, I mean, I was up then. You feel me? I was up when I met him. I could have signed anybody. You get what I'm saying? So, you know. So I, you're a natural AR. I've been doing that though, but I, but instead I'd rather give a nigga the game, like how to be his own boss, how to build his label, how to build his brand, how to, you know, how to do this shit. You feel me? How to be successful. I don't I don't wanna sign nigga and then we get into it tomorrow, you feel me? And and all this old weirdo ass shit going on. I don't do all that. Like I right, bro, listen, do it like this. And I can only tell you how I did it. I don't know how the next man did it. You get what I'm saying? So this is how I did it, bro. Open your Instagram up, bro. Don't don't have your Instagram private. You're a rapper. You get what I'm saying? Oh, you about to go to jail? Get the free campaign going. You feel me? Okay, these are artists. Okay, yeah. Put them on every CD you want. You get what I'm saying? Or just whatever. Start your LLC. Get your business account. You get what I'm saying? File your taxes. You feel me? Write off this. Whatever it may be. Oh, you need to get some CDs pressed up? Okay, this is who I go through. You get what I'm saying? You shoot some videos. Here go my cameraman. You know, I always been that nigga, bro, to... um. To lend a helping hand when a nigga need it. I ain't never been the, the the selfish, the greedy, the hating type of person. You feel me? I want to see everybody win, bro. Even from off the block. Used to lead the block, go to shows. I had five, six chains on. Huh, everybody put one on. You get what I'm saying? I don't want to be the only one on stage with, 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 a, with a chain on. Only one looking like we, you get what I'm saying? Let us all shine. Uh, that's real. You feel like money, clout, it, it, it changes people the way... I, I for sure do. I for sure that, you know, money changed people to where, like, you know, when a nigga was, wasn't was having it, they was different. And once they get up, it, it do. Especially if you are already not a genuine person. It's for sure going to come out. You feel me? If you're not a, a solid person, a loyal person, it's for sure going to come out because you're going to feel yourself. You're going to feel like, okay, I made it. Nigga, they can't tell me nothing. Nigga, I'm, I'm the nigga. Like, what? But you're going to forget about all that 
other shit that you, you feel me, did in the past. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on. And forget that you was broke. 